Good morning, this is Cindy and I'm the Tireless Tangler. Welcome. Today is the 12th day of the 100 day project and today's tangle for our 100 days of Zen Tangle for today is Avriel. This is a Zen Tangle uh, original pattern and they, I, I don't believe there is a written step out for it published. However, um, they did do a video on this in the last project back uh, that you can find here on YouTube if you want to see that. I believe that was um, something they used in the spinner project pack in project pack four. So um, anyway, so um, this is not a tough one to figure out and uh, let me show you really quickly how to uh, draw this and we'll put it in the pattern. Okay, so you're gonna start with narrow parallel lines and then you fill these with little perfs or pearls or orbs or whatever you want to call them they all pretty much mean the same thing We speed videos up, but I think it's important sometimes for people to see just how slowly, uh, just how slowly the drawing is going. So then you just want to make crossed lines. You can keep them fairly even if when you put your first line uh, out there you try to keep it parallel with the one that came before and the other one sort of falls into place. Okay, that's step two. Then the rest of this is pretty much straight lines. I'm going to go to each of your diamonds in the middle, divide that in half, and then you want to um, hatch the right side of that, or the left side, but choose one. Don't do both. Well, I suppose you can do both. <laughs> Nothing that says you can't. It'll just make a cooler pattern if it's uniform. Okay, and I am sort of hurrying here. Sometimes the straight lines go better if I don't wait around too long. Okay, and then the last step is to make straight lines going the other direction in all of the triangles left except for the one across from where we started. And we have pretty much done the shading with, with our inked lines with this and with the change in direction. So forgive me for rushing through this. Sorry. Okay. So this is our basic pattern, Abriel. Okay. Let's put it in the pattern for, or in the template. 
and see how it looks. Okay, so zoom out again. This is, this would be, hmm, let's put it right here. I don't think it'll work for this mess, but it'll work right here. I think we need more of a grid pattern for this one. So let's see. So I'm going to start with my um, outer auras. And I think I'm going to put one more Aura in here on each side and do my uh, little perfs right there with that little white strip in between the edge of the section and where we're drawing. I think that's going to work better overall uh, for separation and visibility on it. Okay, so not a bad start and over here we'll do the same thing there we go Okay, and now to add in the X's, that's going to be a little awkward to turn this corner, but let's see how we do. going to work. Hmm. Probably not very well. Let's see. Well, you know what? That might work out okay. Let's see what we... Let's see what that gets us. Um, okay, so let's divide this here. And oops. Okay, and that will be light, and then, hmm, this is going to be a little backwards here, so I think I'm going to do this one, see if anybody notices. <laughs> okay, this will come down here. Hmm. Okay. Well, let's let's uh, finish up and see how it looks. Hmm. 
Now I kind of need to figure out something here. Um, you know what? I think I'm going to go ahead and fill this one in, even though it technically shouldn't. Then I think that will sort of cover up the... Except we sort of still need something here. Okay, so when I go through and put my horizontal lines, I'm not going to fill this section in because I need one that's going to be white. And then I'll fill this in. And we'll put these straight across. finished with this one which is good because I'm about to kill YouTube in the other room mm. we'll go ahead and do this one okay you know what that is very strange looking but you know what it's okay I can deal with it all right <laughs> that is my um, approximation of Avril in this corner. And uh, let's put a little bit of shading on there and we'll be done for today. Simba says hi to everyone, by the way. He appreciates the fan club. He, he likes the fact that other dogs bark when they hear him on the video. That's cool with him. <laughs> Say hi, Simba. He's like, not right now, I'm taking a nap. tiny bit of shading right here right here let's see how that looks I'm not sure shading can help my mess but you know what this is gonna be cool when when this is done this is certainly gonna be unique from anything else <laughs> my my pieces of art are always unique and I'm okay with that Well, this is not going to be my favorite square. I'm going to add some more shading in here in a minute. I think I'll do some right around the edges here and uh, see if I can perk it up a little bit. But I've got a lot more extra shading I want to do on this before um, anything definitive is done. So this is our Avril pattern for the 12th day of 100 Days of Zentangle, the 100 Days Project. And I thank you all for coming uh, and watching. And uh, I noticed yesterday I hit 700 subscribers on my channel. I'm so excited. And you guys all helped to make that happen. And I appreciate it very much. Thank you. And I will see you tomorrow for our weekend edition of the 100 Day Project. Bye.